Okay, class, take a seat. We're gonna be starting with our lesson. So, bro, this room is so cold. I know, right? Why is the temperature so low? Bro, I'm just gonna wear my hoodie. I'm not dealing with this. Wait a minute, what if she yells at you? Bro, it's a hoodie. What's the worst that could happen? So can anybody- Fire me! Why? Why? Take that hoodie off right now! Why? It's so cold in here! I don't care about that! You can't wear hoodies in my classroom! And you can't have the temperature down to below zero! Simon, it's not even that cold! Besides, the freezing cold temperature is supposed to keep you awake, like- Do you not see how you just contradicted yourself? Simon, if you don't stop complaining about the temperature, I'm gonna send you to the principal! I'm not gonna stop complaining about the temperature until you- What? I don't know. Normally it cuts to the principal's office whenever I'm yelling mid-sentence. That's because I'm already here. Oh, wow. What seems to be the problem? Simon is wearing a hoodie in my class, principal! Only because the temperature is so low, it feels like I'm in a tundra! Okay, let me just check the thermostat. Principal, I see nothing wrong with mine. Negative 12 degrees? Are you crazy? Oh, please! You're overreacting! You're teaching class in an igloo! You're fired! What is fire? Okay, class, take a seat. I'm gonna put you in Paris for your next assignment. Oh, dude, I'm not looking forward to seeing my partner. True, but it's also fun to see who other people have to work with. Oh, yeah? Like who? Greg, you're gonna be working with Doug. Thank you, T. Ah! Yes, ma'am. Okay, Doug, listen. I'm the smart person in the group, so just let me do all the thinking, okay? Who's Doug? You are! Ugh, just let me think. Oh, I can help. I have so many ideas, like... Stop it, Doug. I don't need help from someone who has the same IQ as toilet water. <laughs> Hey Greg, Doug, uh, I've been looking around the classroom and I kind of noticed you guys haven't started yet. Well, that's because you put me with the dumbest kid in the classroom! Greg, that's not nice. At least give him a chance, okay? How can I have faith in someone who doesn't even know their own name? Yeah, he sounds pretty stupid. Yeah, because it's you, you ignoramus! No, we just call him ignoramus, no, that's just say wild, Greg, I'm not gonna tolerate bullying in my classroom. Stop it right now or I'm gonna send you to the principal. I won't stand for- A few minutes later. I'm just happy it's not Simon in my office for once. What did you do, Greg? The teacher tried to sabotage me by pairing me with Doug. What's the problem with that? Because Doug is the dumbest kid in the whole school! And if you were as smart as you say you are, you'd figure out how to make it work. Oh, what? Okay, class, take out your homework. We're going to go over it. So, when we take a look at question one, we can see that the answer is clearly three. What? I didn't get that. Hey, teacher? Yes, Simon? I'm looking at the homework and I got 14 is my answer. Well, did you check your work? Let's take care of one minus two. Yeah, I still 14. Well, then clearly you weren't paying attention to my class. What about you, Greg? I also got 14, teacher. See, Simon, it- What? Yes, I think Simon was correct. Let me see that. It's 14. Yeah, I told you. Simon, can I just see you in the hallway for a little bit? Whoa. Oh, he's in trouble. Uh -oh. I'm not in trouble. Yeah, we'll see about that. A few minutes later. So what's this about, am I- Don't you ever embarrass me in that classroom again! <laughs> What do you mean? What makes you think you have the right to correct me in my own classroom like that? Oh, I don't know. Maybe because you were wrong? I don't tolerate this disrespect. Go to the principal right now. No need. I'm already here. Ooh, a twist. So what seems to be the problem this time? Simon had the audacity to tell me my work was wrong. Here. What's seven plus seven? How did we hire you? I can't breathe. Simon! Hi, Mom. It's been a while. You need to clean this room right now. Mom, I just got home. Can I just wait for a little bit? <coughs> it's the lazy sun for me. Oh no. Oh my God. Where did you learn that? I'm learning new slang so I can stay woke. Why? Why are you trying to fit in? Well, in order to keep up with the young people, I had to yassify my language. You are too old to be sounding that illiterate. Simon, I'm not that old. You're ancient. You're just mad because I'm becoming a girl boss. I should have just cleaned my room. So you see how cool I sound now, right? No, you don't. It's cringe. Stop it. Excuse me? You're you're low-key and up. Oh, you did not just call me that, dad. Five seconds of quiet is all I ask. Are you guys fighting again? <sighs> I wish. So why are you guys calling me in here? He's just being an op because my new slang is goals. All right, I'm calling the pastor because she's clearly possessed. Hello there. Wait, what? Simon! I asked for so little. What do you want? I told you to do the dishes an hour ago. Why aren't they done? I was busy with homework. I was gonna do- So you're just making up excuses now. How is that an excuse to- No, I don't want to hear it. I've obviously failed as a mother. Nah, come back. Excuse me? How does me not doing the dishes mean that you failed as a mother? Well, maybe if you washed the dishes, I wouldn't have to feel like this. I already do a bunch of other chores. You can't say that. So not only are you not gonna do the dishes, but you're yelling at your mother as well. No. Oh my God, you know crying's not gonna work with me, right? Son of a nutcracker. Stop trying to guilt trip me by saying you failed as a mother. Well, I wouldn't have to say that if you didn't fail as a son. 
That's really messed up. I'm getting your father, honey. I'm in Spain without the S. What do you want? Our son is being a failure. Apparently all because I didn't do the dishes. Exactly, failure. Okay, our son gets straight A, stays away from drugs, and just got into graduate school. How is he a failure? Because he, well, you're a- uh... Simon, just do the dishes tonight and you're good. Yes, sir. Okay, class, that's the end of our lesson. Pack up your things and have a good weekend. Yo, he's supposed to assign his homework, right? Maybe he forgot, but don't tell him, okay? Wait, teacher, you forgot to give us homework over the weekend. I can't with this oh kid, Oh my bro. god, there's, there's no way he's I hate you all my so plans much. And now oh yeah, that's right. Everyone get your notebooks out so you can write down the assignment, okay? Thank you, teacher. Greg, you bumbling idiot. What's the problem, Simon? Don't you like doing homework on the weekend? No, nobody does. It's like the worst way to spend a weekend. Wait, you mean to tell me your parents don't lock you in a room and force you to do fractions all day? I need to call CPS or something? Either way, any time doing homework is time well spent. You're not a PSA! Stop trying to be a hero, okay? Simon, why are you yelling at Greg again? Why are you assigning us homework over the weekend? Why can't you have amnesia? Simon, relax. The homework isn't even that bad. Oh, really? What is it? Oh, you know, just a 20-page essay on how you would achieve world peace. So. What? Yeah, it's nothing much, really. You could totally do it. A few minutes later. Simon, why did you yell at Greg in class? Greg reminded the teacher to give homework over the weekend. You called him a cotton-headed ninny-muggins! What does that even mean? I don't know, but it made him cry, so... GET OUT! Simon! We were doing so well. What do you want? Why are there dirty dishes in the kitchen? I don't know, I wasn't in the- Well, you need to go clean them right now! But I didn't even- No buts! In this house, we always clean up after ourselves! But I didn't cause that mess in the kitchen! My little brother did! Oh, really? I'll get him now! Little Jimmy? Yes, mother? Did you cause that mess in the kitchen? <sighs> yeah, sorry, mom. You see? Well, that's okay. Simon will clean it up. See, now you- what? Oh, I'm sorry, is there a problem? Oh, uh, yeah, actually. Why do I have to clean it up? Simon, sometimes you have to pick up the slack for other people. You can't make me do that. This is favoritism. Simon, don't be ridiculous. <laughs> I don't have a favorite child. Oh, yeah? When Jimmy got a C on his test the other day, you said good job. Okay, so? But when I got an A- minus on mine the other day, you called me a failure. I won't tolerate these possibly true accusations. I'm getting your father. Honey. I've run out of one-liners. What do you want? Simon thinks I like Jimmy more than him. Yeah, because you do. Mom, uh, for Christmas you gave Simon a singular sock, but for Jimmy you got him a new iPhone. He needs it! He's nine! For what? Simon! Why are you yelling? What have I done? I want you to go do the dishes right now. Mom, I'll do them later. Can I just- Are you giving me disrespect? What the- No! How was that- I don't even want to argue. You're gonna get the belt right now. Whoa, 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 chill. I'm sorry, okay? I Trust me, Simon. This hurts me more than it hurts you. No, oh, seriously- Wait, what? You heard me. I said this is gonna hurt- Oh, I heard you. Um- how does that work? Excuse me? How is this gonna hurt you if you're the one with the belt? Because if I hit you, I'm gonna feel pain on the inside. And if you hit me, I'm gonna feel pain on the outside. Believe me, Simon, this is for your own good. No, it's not. You think I wanna hit my son? I'm gonna say yes, cause you wanna hit me over the dishes. You know what? I'm getting your father, honey. I gotta start listening to the voices in my head. What do you want? Our son is being disrespectful. She's saying that hitting me with the belt is gonna hurt her more than me. Yeah, that's definitely not true. What? Yeah, I mean, you're literally choosing to hit him. I don't understand how this is gonna hurt you. You know what? You do it. I'm not dealing with this anymore. What did you even do? Damn it! It's way too early for this. What do you want? School starts in 30 minutes. Why aren't you ready? Mom, I'm tired. Can't you just drive me? Oh, so you're too lazy to walk to school now, huh? No, but it's so far away and I don't feel like walking that. Oh, please. When I was your age, I had to walk halfway across the country to get to school. What the? How did you? And when it was winter, I had to walk without a coat. Barefoot! You would die! And sometimes I had to fight a dragon as well. Dragons aren't even real! So if I went through all that, I don't want to hear your yammering. Okay, you made that up. Excuse me? You really expect me to believe you went through all that just to get to school? Simon, times were a lot different back then. Which times? Narnia? Are you Harry Potter or something? Simon, I'm trying to prove a point. If I can fight a giant to get to school, you should have no problem. I thought it was a dragon. Yeah! A giant dragon! You know, if you didn't spend all this time lying, you could have driven me to school by now. I'm not gonna argue with you anymore. I'm getting your father. Honey... I haven't even had my coffee yet. What do you want? Our son doesn't want to walk to school! Apparently, Mom had to fight a dragon on the way to school. You sound unstable. Unstable. Simon, get in the car. I'll drop you off on my way to work. What? Okay, class. Let's continue with our lesson. When we talked about- Bro, I have to blah, pee blah, so bad. Bro, just ask if you can go. Blah, 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 no, I'm an adult. I'll go whenever I want. So when this was-
Damn it! Literally almost peed myself. What do you want? Where do you think you're going? I'm going to the bathroom. I have to pee. No, you don't. Get back in your seat. But what? You can't just get up and leave for the bathroom like that. But I have to go. It's an emergency. It doesn't seem like an emergency to me. So you want me to pee on the floor is what you're saying. Simon, if you want to go to the bathroom during my class, you have to ask me first. Why? I'm a grown man. Using the bathroom is a basic human right. Well, human rights don't exist in my classroom. Did you just admit to being a dictator? I'm not going to say it again. If you want to go to the bathroom, raise your hand and ask. Just do it, bro. <sighs> yes, Simon? Can I go to the bathroom? I don't know. Can you? You little sh- A few minutes later. Simon, I am this close to entering a monastery. What did you do this time? The teacher was being annoying because she wouldn't let me go to the bathroom. Did you at least find a bathroom on your way here? Oh, so about that, I- Why is there pee on the floor? If I didn't have neighbors, I'd scream right now. What do you want? I need you to do the dishes right now. I already did them. What? Uh, well, I need you to take out the trash. I did that too. Huh? Uh, well, you need to. To do what? I finished all my chores in case you're wondering. That's not true. I have some more chores for you. Like what? What else could you have me do? Well, I need you to, um... Mow the homework again. You gotta be kidding me. And I need you to, uh, uh fold the lawn. Yeah. That's not pu- And I need you to walk the fish. We don't even have a fish. And if you don't get this done in an hour, you're grounded. So let me get this straight. You're making up chores now because you're upset that I actually did my job? Simon, I don't see the problem. All these chores are perfectly reasonable. You're asking me to bend the laws of reality. How is that reasonable? So you won't bend the laws of reality, but you'll bend your body to relax on that bed, huh? Something about that sounds wrong. You know what? I'm getting your father. Honey. Where's a hammer? when you need it. What do you want? Our son won't do his chores. I just saw him doing his chores an hour ago. What do you mean? Nope. He still has to walk the homework, mow the fish, and mow the lawn. That wasn't even the correct order. Yeah, are you drunk? What? Okay, class, so let's continue with our lesson. When we talked about- blah, This class blah, is blah, so blah, long. Blah, I know, blah, right? Blah, I just blah, wanted blah, to end. Blah. After we learned about this- Ring, 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 ring. Oh, ring. Class is God, over. Finally Get out. Leave. Anyway, when we- Simon! What, uh, what is it, teacher? Where do you think you're going? I'm going home. Class is I don't think so. Get back into your seat. But the bell rang. It's time to leave. The bell doesn't dismiss you. I do. Okay, so that's stupid. Excuse me? No, let me explain. If the bell doesn't dismiss us, then why is it there? Simon, the bell doesn't apply to me and you know it. Oh, so you think you're important now? Yes, I can keep you as long as I want. I have tenure. What kind of logic is that? I don't care how long it takes. This lesson is over when I finish covering the material. Why are you doing this anyway? None of us even want to be here. I do. Greg, shut up. Simon, I'm going to get the principal if you don't stop causing a ruckus. Yeah, right. Like he'd actually show up. Excuse me, I'm hearing a lot of yelling. What's going on? Oh, you showed up. This student won't let me teach my class. That makes no sense. Exactly! So maybe you should- No, it makes no sense because the bell already rang. Huh? Class is over. Let them go home. What is ho Okay, class, take a seat. I just finished grading your test, so I'm gonna hand them back now. Yo, who do you think got the highest score? Obviously, it was Greg, bro. Greg, you got a 99. Thank you, teacher. Oh, before I forget, I just want to congratulate the student who got the highest score in the class. Obviously, who else it was could it Greg, be? bro. Who, who else, else could it be? I know, I'm a genius. And that smart. student is Doug. What? Oh, word. Yeah, Doug, you got a 100. Wait a minute, this isn't right. Teacher? Yeah, Greg, what's up? How did Doug get a higher score than me? That's impossible. Greg, relax. It's only one point. You both got an A+. Well, clearly you made a mistake. I'd like a recount of the points, please. Greg, I didn't make a mistake. Maybe Doug just studied more. But that doesn't make sense. Doug shouldn't have passed at all. Oh, yeah? And why is that? Because Doug is the dumb kid. No, no way. Okay, so if Doug is the dumb kid and he got a higher score than you, doesn't that make you dumber? Oh, oh my god! god. I'm leaving. This right, is great. Right. Oh, wait, how did you get a 100 anyway? Oh, I put C for every answer. This has to be a war crime. What do you want? I need you to clean the bathroom right now. But I cleaned it last week. Why do I have to do- Because in this house, we only stand clean people. No, not again. Not again. Yeah, you like that, huh? I'm in my cool mom era. And I'm in my I'm not cleaning the bathroom till you stop era, okay? Excuse me? Don't be mad because you've got L bathroom riz, okay? <laughs> you didn't even use that right. What does that mean? What are you doing? I'm giving you a side eye because you're not listening to your mother. I'm not even- Dad, if I have to call the church again, I'm gonna scream. Um, excuse me? Not both of you trying to gatekeep my purr. So you're gonna call somebody? Yeah, the travel agency. I'm moving to Europe. I can't do this anymore. Hot!